everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Emily and I love handbags, I love fashion, travel, and luxury. So if you like any or all of those things, definitely consider subscribing. Today's video is a fashion video. It is sort of also my way to plan out my outfit for my next trip to Hawaii. And it's been so long since I've been on a trip that I feel like I need more time to figure out what outfits I should bring. And I like to pack light, meaning that's not true. I like to pack a lot of things, but I like to pack so that I don't have to carry many, many suitcases. If I could fit everything in one carry-on, that would be like perfect, right? So I try to reuse certain items. I try to like make use of space and everything. But um, today's video is mainly about sort of the summary outfits that I would bring to my trip so that I hope this will be inspiration to some of you who might be wanting to dress up again for the warmer months and yeah. <laughs> so I do have a list here because there are quite a few outfits and I wanna make sure I didn't miss any. Um, so pardon me while I, you know, glance down here. I will be putting mod shots onto the screen so that you could see what it looks like on. But again, it's all done in this room. So if you wanna see what the outfits actually look like or you wanna see what I, do on my trip, definitely follow me on my Instagram at clutch to carry all or come back here and I'll try to po like do a vlog style video for my trip when I come back. So yeah, let's get started. All right, so the first item I wanna show you is gonna be a big workhorse in my outfits in all of the spring and summer and fall, actually all year round. And so it's not just for the, you know, summer outfit lookbook vacation guide here, but I do love it very much all year round, but I wanted to show you, it's this pair of trousers. This is by the brand Marine Layer, and it is so soft. I don't know if you can see it. It has this very elegant and flattering ankle cut up so that it exposes your ankle. I have it in a petite extra small here, um, which I'm really glad because not all brands do petites. And so if I had to shorten this pair of, of trousers, it would have lost the nice cut at the bottom. So because it is made petite, then I didn't have to do anything and I keep the style. So this is a great one. I will likely wear this on my trip during the, like when I'm in the airport or something because it's just so comfortable, so easy. There are pockets, it goes with everything. I can wear it with so many different pairs of shoes. And yeah, it's just very easy to match as well because it's this dark navy color. Um, I'll be linking this below along with everything I talk about here if I could find it. Some of them might be sold out because some of them I did buy early last year and never got to use it but finally got to use it a year later so yeah. To match with that I would also put on this tank. This is a silk tank from Everlane. It is so breezy, so easy. It is adjustable. There are buttons back here to adjust. There's two lengths to adjust and it's so comfortable. It's very airy. So for Hawaii where it's a little bit more hot and humid or anywhere, you know, summer months, it'd be really nice and it just lays really nicely. I know that it does get cold, it could get cold. So I do plan on bringing a little puffer jacket here. I know it's an overkill for, uh, <laughs> for the, the, summer months but I do plan on going on a uh, sunrise hike in the very high mountains when I'm, when I'm in Hawaii so that it does get cold so people have said I've read reviews that it'll get really cold which is why I'm going to bring this but I figured I would probably pop this on in on the plane if the AC gets too too much and too cold so that would go well together. I also wanted to point out that on my way back I'll likely wear the same pair of bottoms, but I'll probably match it with something else. So I have a blouse here. This is from Cezanne and it's one of my favorite brands. So like, it's one of my favorite brands. I've been stocking up on so many of their pieces. My closet's going to be all Cezanne soon, but it's this really airy, flowy, uh, sort of blue colored floral blouse. I have a little cami here. I don't think I need it. It's not see-through unless I wear a really bright bra. I have a nude bra, it'd be fine, but I have one here just in case. But I think this would go well with those um, bottoms as well that I showed you earlier. And this one can also go with jackets and you know um, the puffer jacket as well. Another way I would wear that pair of trousers is with this knitted tee top. It's kind of a very flattering uh, because it has a square top, uh, square neck line. And this is also from Cezanne. I have this top in three colors now because I, I just love the cut and the feel and just everything about it. And yeah, all, all of these pieces are machine washable, which is 
a big plus because when when I get clothing that says you need to dry clean it's like well how am I going to get them dry clean so I just don't end up wearing them very often so I as as often as I can I try to get machine washable items um, I do have shoes I'm going to bring and I try to bring shoes that would go with more, more than one outfit. These ones are my Rothy's. They're the pointed toe flats in the, I think this is a special edition color that I got from them a couple years back, but it's so comfortable and it's washable. So I don't have to worry about the getting them dirty because I can just pop them into the washing machine and wash them. So this would go well with that. I also can wear sandals such as these two. This one is the Baya flats or sandals and these ones are the alohas and these ones are really good for the pool um these ones are leather so i probably wouldn't wear them in anywhere near water but these ones you can definitely because they're rubber based i also have another pair these are wedges these are my castagna wedges if you saw my unboxing I probably like last year, I did buy a pair of these and have been waiting to wear them and now is the time. So these will also go well with th those outfits as well. And with the outfit, I will likely carry this big tote bag from Rothy's because again, it is great for the airport to fit everything in there as my personal item. It has a zipper, but it's also washable, which I have found would be great if I have to toss it, you know, um, under the seat in front of me on the plane or anything, I can just wash it. So I think this is a great piece to bring. It's comfortable. It is a little bit heavy, but it's sturdy. So I don't have to worry about it getting damaged when I, you know, uh, drop it on the ground or something like that. So I just went through three outfits there using the same pair of you know, trousers, you can always mix and match the tops with other things as well. One of the next items I want to talk about that I'm, I know I'm going to bring is my swimsuit. And I have one here, which I think I just got from Target a few years ago, but it's just a basic, you know, bikini style and then uh, bikini style top and bottoms. They're really summery and fun. And I brought a dress to wear with it. This one I actually bought in Bali. I'll try to link similar items below if I could find it. But this is basically another halter that you can just pop right over your swimsuit, which is great if you want to look decent but still be ready for the, the beach. So while in Hawaii, I will likely go on a hike or do something active. So I decided to bring a pair of leggings. These are by the brand Sweaty Betty and I love them because they have a zip pocket in the back here but they also have a slip pocket on the side of the leggings so I can easily slip my phone in there or if I want something more secure like for my cards or cash or keys I can slip them in the back with a zip pocket. So this is great. I just uh, decided to pair this with a very simple tea this one is by the brand i think yeah vince it's so soft um i don't know if you can see how soft it's flowy and soft it's just perfect so i can easily wear it with these leggings and yeah i will link this below i believe i got this on sale i think it's still on sale for like 35 dollars or something like that or maybe even less than that so i'll link these below but yeah these are very comfortable and i also actually just picked up a pair of water shoes these are water slash hiking running shoes and i figured if i am hiking near waterfalls which i do plan on doing these will be good because if it if if I get them wet or if I even jump into the water with them, they'll be fine um, because they'll just dry really quickly. And they have like really nice grips so that if there are slippery rocks, I should be safe. I also did want to point out some bags that I will be bringing with me. Um, I in the in the cutaway, you probably already seen some of these. This is one of my newest bags, and it's by Marie de la Roche. It is their Octavio bag, and it looks so pretty. It could be worn so many ways. I have it as a backpack right now, but you can also convert it into a crossbody shoulder bag. And there's also a, a top handle, which you can easily carry. I do plan on bringing this with me, um, probably for photos and just around because it's so easy to get in and out of. And it, it is water resistant, humidity resistant. So it's like perfect for this trip. Oh, and of course the color just goes with everything that I have here. I also wanted to point out this bag. You might be familiar with it already. This is the Sen Rev Aluna and I just got this color. This is the mauve color, mauve color. That I've been wanting to get it and it finally went on sale so I, I just grabbed it right away. If you are interested 
in this bag. I do have a promo code. Um, I also have a promo code for Marie de la Roche Octavio. So you get $75 off the Marie de la Roche with the promo code MLOVES and $50 off of this Senref one with the promo code ANGELIN50 at checkout. So yeah, great time to grab these if you're interested and to save a little bit of money. I also will be bringing this bag with me and this one is by the brand Yode. I did unbox this in a previous video, so I'll link that below if you wanted to see it, but it is so cute. It is this very sort of creamy white summery color and it has a top handle, a, a crossbody shoulder strap, and, it's, and it even has a zipper on the inside to keep things very safe. And I just, I think this will be very lightweight and easy to, you know, just carry around. I guess I may as well talk about this bag now too. This is the other bag that I will be bringing and it's my Chanel mini reissue in the calfskin black leather and gold hardware. I love this bag. I will be bringing this one because the all the reissues can be pressed down. I don't know if you can see. Um, and so when I travel, I don't wanna store it this way, but when I travel, it will not get damaged if I do this. So. I do plan on bringing this and this one, um, unlike the minis, this mini reissue can be adjustable to cross body, shoulder, and as a shorter shoulder because the strap can't be doubled up. Okay, I think those are all the bags. Sorry, I had a like, little bag interjection. I just thought I'd tell you all of them because you'll probably see them in the cutaway outfits anyway. So I thought I'd share them with you here first. I think I might have missed this one earlier, but this is a uh, sweatshirt that I just recently got from Victoria's Secret and I, I just loved it because it says do big things. I thought that was kind of cute, but this is so snuggly and it has a little drawstring bottom where it cinches in the waist. So you can wear them shorter, like cropped, um, depending on what your out, your, you know, your bottoms look like. But yeah, I just thought this would be so nice to throw over, um, like my tank earlier. If I, if I had a silk tank and it gets cold and I don't want to wear a jacket, um, this would be very snuggly and um, nice. It could also go with my more athletic outfits. Um, when I'm on a hike, for example, I can throw this on and yeah, it'll just be a really nice piece to have lounging or anything active, just anything, you know? Next, I have this beautiful dress. This one I actually did buy recently. Uh, I got it from Nordstrom, I believe. I'll link it below, but this is by the brand Farm Rio. It is new to me and I have been loving all their pieces. I want to get everything pretty much but i i ended up with this one for now i will pro i would like i will go back and get more so we'll see they have so many fun prints perfect for the summertime i highly recommend checking them out they have all different size shapes length um but this one in particular is i think it's called the dream garden print but it's so beautiful the sleeves just look yeah this will be a perfect waterfall photo dress dress photo i don't know is it weird that I'm thinking about where I'm going to take photos with? Anyway, I think this will pair very nicely with my Aloha sandals from Hermes and it will also go really well, likely with my Baya sandals as well. So yeah, I don't know if you can see the color just goes so well together and I probably will go well with my flats and with my Castagna wedges. I have a lot of options. Next is a dress and cropped blazer combo I'm very excited about. I bought this actually a, maybe a month ago, so it should still be in stock, but I will link them below if I can find it. It is this gorgeous maxi, oh my gosh, you can't see it. Look at, look at it in the cutaway, but it's so pretty. It's smocked right around the bust area, and it just has these tiers of fabric that it's in the same color. It's so soft and swishy and so light, and it is uh, uh, sort of a thick spaghetti strap. I, I teamed it with this green crop blazer because I just think it looks so cool and chic, but then, you know, it's linen, so it'll keep me nice and cool while, while giving some like sun coverage. But yeah, I think these just go so well together. It is quite long, so I think I could put get away with flats, but I think it'll probably be better with my Castagna wedges actually. So yeah, I probably will, will be wearing it with those. Next, I brought something a little bit more dressy to wear for like a nice dinner. And it is this Zimmerman dress. I love Zimmerman for dresses. Actually, I think my favorite dress brand might be from Zimmerman, but it is this beautiful white, I think it's linen. Yeah, it feels like linen. And it has these gorgeous, 
embroidery all throughout, but it's spaced very nicely. So it definitely gives you a like a really nice silhouette when you wear it. it fla it's very flattering. So yeah, I, I thought, you know, for summertime, of course, we must bring something white. And I think this will pair very nicely with my Chanel bag. It could pair nicely with pretty much all of my bags here. But yeah, I'm probably gonna wear this with my Castagna wedges again, because it is a little bit longer. And I'm quite short, I'm only 5'1", so, um, and that's 155 centimeters. So I will likely need the extra boost. Moving on to another maxi dress, but not bright white. It's gonna be a slightly off-white cream color. And it is this beautiful one shoulder togo like dress. It does have the tear again, again, it's very long. And it has this beautiful sort of cord string rope tie right here. And I just tie this into a bow. And I think this will go so well with any of my like sandals, wedges, flats, anything. It will also look really nice with all of my bags. I think a color bag will pop really nicely with this dress, but I can also see myself wanting to wear something white so to create like an all white outfit. It'll be very cute. So I haven't really decided what I want to do yet, but yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll have all the stuff with me. So. I'll have the option that day, what I feel like, I'll wear it. <laughs> the final outfit I wanted to share with you here before going into some accessories is this Zimmerman dress. Again, I bought this one, I think late last year, so I'm not sure if it's gonna be available, but they always come out with similar styles, just different prints. I remember seeing a white version of this and it's so pretty, but I decided to go with a dark navy one. This one actually has pockets. I was like, oh my gosh, that's like a dream. Uh, it is quite short, it's a mini, and it does have these removable shoulder straps, so you can wear it as a spaghetti strap, or you can wear it as a strapless dress, and it's so pretty. Like, it's this linen material. Again, has the very beautiful floral print at the bottom. It also has these really cute buttons that go up down the top. It doesn't do anything functionally, but it does make it look really nice. And I could, I could see myself wearing this with my Chanel bag. I can see myself wearing this with the uh, bio handles, but also the wedges would look really cute as well and oh, the flats as well So I I think I think all of my shoes are very versatile um, in with all of these outfits Which is why I'm bringing them. But yeah, I think this one will also go really nicely with like a little cardigan You know like this. Um, so if it gets cold then I then I I can stay warm that way. This cardigan is by Cezanne and it is it has a little see-through I don't know if you can see through it, but it is it is knitted in cotton, so it's breathable, but there's also this, it has this very spaced out knitting that will allow you to feel cool, but you know, give you a little bit of warmth if it gets a little bit cooler at nighttime. I'm not sure if I pointed this one out yet. I also decided to bring a shell. This one is very lightweight. It doesn't, it doesn't give you much warmth, but if it does start to rain, this one is waterproof, it is windproof. So when I am on the hike or something that gets really, for some reason, pouring, I will be, covered, I won't get too wet, it, has, it also has a little hood. So yeah, I thought I'd bring this one as well. And I of course have an extra set of swimsuits so that in case I need to go swimming and my other one's not dry, because wet swimsuit's so hard to put on, uh, I thought I'd bring an extra one. This one is so cute, this is in this like gingham print. I think this one is by, it's by Sea Folly. I did get it when I was in Australia, I think, oh, a couple of years now. Time flies. <laughs> so those are all the outfits, and I would like to share some accessories with you. I'm gonna be bringing these sunglasses. These are by the brand Tom's. They're very lightweight, and uh, with Tom's, every pair of sunglasses you buy, it, it does donate a pair of glasses to a child in need, which is really great. I also have my hat. This one is foldable and it's washable and it's it's not like a fashionable hat but it does look cute and it does give sun coverage and yeah <laughs> easy to pack. I don't know if you, if you have the same problem but I find I find like straw hats so hard to pack. I don't know where to put them and everything so I also have this. This is from Cezanne. It was a gift actually with one of the purchases that I made but yeah it is so pretty. It's just like jewelry item. I'm going to put my 
bracelet in here as well and, and my necklace in here this one is from vita sienna and yeah i'll probably put this one in this little pouch and zip it up I, this one is from hermes i just unboxed it um so i'm really excited to bring it with me but that'll probably go in here as well at the top i'll have rings i think i'm gonna put my wedding band and engagement ring here but i do have two pairs of earrings this one is by the brand Ana Luisa and this one is so pretty I'll try to insert some photos if I can if I find any but yeah this one's also for good for sensitive ears because I believe it's sterling silver this one is by the brand Astrid and Miyu, and again it's sterling silver post and it has these like triple pearls it's gonna be look really pretty so I brought two that were more versatile different so that I could trade them off but yeah, I, I'm, I'm loving those too, so I'm really glad. Oh, with the Ana Luisa one, so this one, I do have a referral link. You get $15 off if you click it and, and make a purchase. So yeah. I just wanted to give you all of the promo codes that I can think of. I'll also list every, all of it below because I know it's hard to remember. And the last things I wanna mention here, I already mentioned this one, are actually my suitcases. I have two that I'm gonna be bringing. I'm probably gonna give one to my husband to bring. One of them, this one I'm gonna hold, is this beautiful steam line luggage i have shown this once i have brought it on one trip because there wasn't much traveling to be done but it's so gorgeous it has like two handles here it also has a telescopic handle and the inside it's beautiful i'll try to insert some photos of it if i can otherwise i'll insert a previous video of where i showed you how i pack my suitcase the other suitcase that I will be bringing, like I said, my husband will probably be the one bringing this one, is this one from Away. I have not been able to use this one because I haven't traveled since I bought it, but this one's really nice in that it does have these, it is a hard case, so they're both hard cases, but it has zippers in the front. I don't know if um, you've traveled before and with, it, with a hard case, it's, it's nice because it keeps all of your stuff very secure and padded, but it's really hard to get in and out if you want to if you want to just grab something really quick so this one is nice it also has a tsa built-in lock as well as a charging station um, you can carry on these kind of suitcases as long as you um take out the battery which i took out to charge right now so as long as you can do that you can bring this on board you just have to be able to detach it from your suitcase that is my summer outfit vacation lookbook for you. If you are interested in my trip and what I end up doing, definitely follow me on my Instagram at Clutch to Carry All or follow me here because I will try to do a vlog style documentation of my trip. So I will link everything below. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments below and I'll try to get back to you. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.